Hey, what's going on YouTube? This is Kirby306539 with another video. And today I will be showing you how to dramatically speed up your Mozilla Firefox browser. Now you may have you may have watched my how to speed up Internet Explorer video. I highly recommend you watch it if you are a Windows user. It really works, trust me. Um and Mozilla Firefox, I guarantee, will help you too. Or at least, I hope it will. I really hope it will help. Uh, it's almost guaranteed, though. But, uh, let's go and get started. Uh, okay. First off, I'm gonna go ahead and show you this document. Uh, there are a few things here. Uh, it, it's less complicated than you think. But, um, first off, there is this application called Firefox Preloader. Um, what it does, it is just when you start up, when you log on to your uh, Windows account each time, uh, Firefox Preloader should open up automatically and will preload um, each or a uh, few files from, fire, from the Mozilla Firefox folder, which will allow Firefox to be enhanced and open quicker. <coughs> Alright. And originally, before I did any of this stuff, my Firefox browser took about a minute to turn on. Like, um, I clicked it, and then I had to wait about a minute for it to even begin to open. It was ridiculous. And I just, I just got really mad. So, uh, I just got fed up with it so far where I just Google searched it and found a few things. YouTube searched it too. And one thing I found was Firefox Preloader. It is an old program, but it works with all versions of Windows. I'm going to work with Mac too. Um, and it has not been updated because everyone thinks it's so good. And does not, it does not need to be updated, which I agree with them. It really works. When I originally downloaded Preloader, and it went from about one minute to about 30 seconds, which is still a ridiculous time to wait. Um, <coughs> but go ahead and download it, um, learn about it, go ahead and YouTube search it. Um, just, I don't know, Google, YouTube search it, just type in Firefox Preloader, and probably some videos or sites will come up. I'll provide a link in the description to download it, and be sure to try it out. It's really good. I just minimize that. Um, next, uh, it's for a boost of your Firefox startup. So, to speed up the startup of your Firefox browser and then a boost. This will enhance the um, Firefox opening, which means this file that um, you can download for it uh, will work with Preloader and enable it to cut down on Preloader time half as much. Like, if for example, it goes from one minute to 30 seconds, and for me, when I use this file, it went from about 30 seconds to about five seconds, which is excellent. Five seconds is tolerable time. So I'll provide a link in the description, but I'm gonna go ahead and go there um, right now, so you can see. Check it out. Go and open Firefox. It's gonna be a little slow because. Um, and some more applications running down here. <coughs> so, first off, just give it some time to open. Finally. Oh, I'm sorry. I take this long. It's been going a little slow recently. But it's a new browser and everything. I don't really know how it's gonna work, how it's working. But it's I this worked a lot better. I mean this one opens a faster map. 
I was originally using Firefox version 3.6.15 or something, and that took forever in a day uh, without any other programs running to help help it. And it took forever. This one took pretty a pretty reasonable amount of time. <laughs> so let's go ahead and let's go ahead and start up. I'm gonna go ahead and go to the website. application script it opens on its own whenever you open Firefox so it doesn't slow down your computer when you're not using it. But it says PX is is a simple but powerful file which by compressing the DLLs and ex executables is able to boost your Firefox startup. Here is a simple procedure to achieve this incredible result. Okay step one first download the UPX file here. So go ahead and click blue text and download the UPX save it um, you can go ahead and save it where you want just make sure you know where you saved it or you can just automatically go ahead and save it to your Mozilla Firefox browser or er, folder in your uh, C drive program files go ahead and save it there um, if you didn't make uh, make sure you do and just click and drag it into the folder and if it has a little window that asks for administrative privileges, just say yes. Alright, so now it's, you can go to run or the search bar down at the bottom if you have a Vista or Windows 7. So just type in CMD or go to the command prompt. do is uh, once you click start and everything open okay first off what you first what you're gonna do is type in CD dot dot press enter then it says again type CD dot dot enter and now you see you're at your C drive okay next it says at this point you should be in the main root. Okay, and now go on and type CD program files and press enter. So CD program files. Enter. And now you type CD Mozilla Firefox. Press enter. And it says now you should be in the Firefox main folder. At this point, you're going to want to type. Um, you're going to type, type this whole thing in bold. It may seem long, but unfortunately, you can't copy and paste it. That's just the way CMD works. You're going to have to type it all by hand. It's alright. It's not that bad. Uh, just, I'll go with you. So go ahead and type what I type. 4 percent, uh, space percent V space in parentheses asterisk dot Slash asterisk dot dll space plugins backslash asterisk dot dll Space. Do. U. P. X. Space. Uh, 
quote C colon backslash for the C drive program files backslash Mozilla Firefox backslash percent V and in quotes in this case. And it'll go through this long process. It's alright, uh, you can see all this text and everything, just don't worry about it, it's doing its job, it's doing what it's uh, doing. So, uh, this will take a minute or two. I'm gonna go ahead and pause the video, and I'll come back when it's finished.